Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, may I welcome you to Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts Alpha 2, 2.83 if I remember correctly. Anyway, I just wanted to show off a little design that I've been scheming and working on. You already notice it's slightly different than... Um, than other designs you may have been witness to. This is the armored cruiser Shandong. It is incredibly lightweight. I've just stripped most of the stuff out, put on a lot of settings to keep the armor uh, weight low. And also I've had to make some sacrifices to keep the cost low as well in order to get the free cruisers for the um, trade convoy raid but you can see on the right here the armaments <laughs> so what I have managed to do is I have got this nine inch bad boy on the front these guns I found could penetrate battleship armor if angled correctly and with the bonuses it is quite a meaty juicy ton of wreckage we have on top two double barreled four inch secondaries yes secondaries this is a new thing that you can do it's taken me a little bit of fiddling to get them to fit on but there they are. I'm glad that the front and rear towers will be able to appreciate their glory. Ignore the clipping. In fact, it's actually, yes, that is actually clipping. I'm sure they'll fix that at some point. On the back, I've actually got two six, well, two, two six inch guns. Uh, because I found that you can put secondaries um, on the back here. But you have to have two main guns. And when I say guns, I mean turrets. So I've just put two primary turrets um, at the back. And I've had to make them six inch in order to keep the cost down. Um, just, uh, yeah. And then I've got how many of these? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight eight five inch secondaries on each side i've got two four inches aft and four on each side and i've got my underwater torpedo tubes as well so this thing is it, it i mean they've called it an armor oh, i mean the ca is supposed to be cruiser armored but it's definitely a heavy cruiser for a cruiser it's big it has barely any armor. I mean, five inches belt. What, 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 this is nothing. There is no armor on this. There's no bulkheads. There's no citadel. There's nothing. There is practically no protection on this at all. But it moves at 24 knots. And has a ridiculous amount of guns. I've even had to fiddle with these bloody funnels in order to just get the engine capacity above 30 percent i mean efficiency so it's like yeah it's what is this do 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 yeah so it's ridiculous but oh boy so sorry just gonna quickly do something there we go so what are we going to do this is the unarmed convoy so this is just going to be it's just going to be gratuitous that's all it's going to be I just wanted to record this glorious moment of perhaps one of my most ridiculous ship designs ever three heavy cruisers of the Chinese Empire against the French okay yeah you know I guess they're trying to fuel their Indo-Chinese um operations and here we are intercepting a convoy enemy smoke is spotted to the north so where's the north the north is that way so we want to go there and do we want to make sure that we're at flank speed now I wonder 
can we see it? Okay. This is a bit different than how I remember, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, let's return to flagship. The Heijiang, the Shandong, and the Hubei. But, yeah. Um, oh, hello, actually. Ship location unknown. Really? Oh, okay. No, they're right there. Oh, shit. We're firing already, apparently. Well, okay. I wasn't expecting that. Wow, okay. I'm just going to bump it up to two times speed. And, oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, there we go. There's a fire. Right off the bat. But I just want to zoom in on my... Like, how many guns have we got? And they're all firing already? Let's have a look. Um... The rear guns have been engaged in the four inches heavens, but like Yeah, this is pretty insane. Are they going to Are they turning around? I think they're turning around. Well we can't allow this, can we? Oh. I just find it funny that I've got a ship which has more guns than a, ba than a battleship. Like, this thing genuinely would be more armoured. I mean, more armed than the Dreadnought, I believe. But I don't know what ships I'd compare it to. I'd have to play the arms convoy to see really how it is. <laughs> They've only just figured out that actually there may be absolutely nothing. Um, in this. Oh. Wow, okay. Yeah, this poor ship. Well, okay. That's the first ship sunk. A warship. It's a warship. It's moving in to engage us. Yeah, but it's just... This fuselage. Fuselage? No, fuselage. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm not sure what these ships are doing. I think... I want to get about there. We're going to keep rushing in, which will limit our firepower we can bear, but it will also bring us closer and... Oh my god. Alright, real time. Well, I say real time. This does feel a bit like slow motion, but oh, we've got the secondaries firing now. Oh dear! Oh my God, that flooding! Yeah, that's that's a that's a sunk transport, all right. Oh, they're trying to repair it. No, that's not going to work. That's really not going to work at all. Come on now. Oh, rip convoy. <laughs> I love the fact that they just reset the model. Oh well, right, on to the next one. Oh, look at these poor transports all freaking out. Yeah, they're, they, they just know they're doomed. Let's try and set it to about here. Oh my gosh. Wait! They have guns! Oh, I didn't realise they have guns. Is it just a two? I think it's literally just a two, three inches. Now, I'd be curious to see if they can actually damage us or not. Assuming they hit for once. Oh, yes! Oh. 
the Vic the Victor Revel. I'm assuming I'm pronouncing it correctly, but of course I'm probably not. As is always the way when you have um, any kind of languages. Oh. See, this is how World War One naval battles are fought, just with overwhelming firepower. <laughs> I want to watch my ships shoot. I want to see these things. Just, just this. This imagery is beautiful. This is what I've always wanted out of a naval game. Oh, we got a hit. <laughs> now, can we tell these guys? Steady screen follow the trees. Uh, air control provision, shelter, gunfire. Um, gunfire at any range. Yeah, go aggressive. Attach. No, I kind of just want them to. I kind of want them to just fire at everything. Okay, so that's their chosen angle of retreat by the looks of things. So that's where we're going to go. But I mean, I made sure that these ships could move quickly because I wanted to make sure that they could pursue targets like this. Although saying that, if it is a destroyer, we'd have to be 26, I think, to catch up anyway. It's, 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 the thing that I love about these ships is they have big guns, they have five and six inches. still outgunning them, like, without a doubt. In fact, I think our sh their shells are just bouncing off us. If they hit at all. Yeah, their shells are doing nothing. Which is quite surprising actually, because these things have like, no armor at all. No, the torpedoes. <laughs> oh dear. I forgot about that. Sheesh. Oh god. <laughs> Punishing. This torpedo is about to hit. Yeah. Why is that thing still floating? Oh, it took a hit. 
Okay, so that one on the left is definitely going to sink by flooding. Like, there's just no chance it's going to recover. Um, yeah, the Victor is probably going to end up... <laughs> the guns are still firing. Oh, those brave sailors. So the Cavalier is down. Oh, you fired the torpedoes at it? <sighs> Alright. So. What will these guys do now? What are they going to shoot at? Because the secondary seems to have more of a free fire situation. But Let's switch targets to that ship. Victor should be going down. I'll be surprised if it doesn't. Oh, this is lethal accuracy. This is not what I'm used to at all. Oh god, they fired torpedoes at it as well. say except this is an absolute onslaught and I love it. <laughs> oh no really <sighs> Oh my god it's survived. Yeah can we just finish this off quickly? Because the thing is holding on and I don't like it. Oh okay, it's 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 going to die. Never mind. Alright. Next target. Yeah, the torpedoes have that. Alright, whoa, hello. Okay. That's a lot of fire. I wasn't expecting that. Well, I mean, I shouldn't be surprised, really, but hey, there we go. Did, did you... did you miss, or what? I mean, this thing... if this thing doesn't die, it will die. Now, what am I saying? Okay, due to heavy flooding. Let's get over here. We're still receiving fires on the lead ship. What <laughs> do we get? This, I do believe this is the definition of a blaze of glory. Right, we're gonna reorder you to go this way. Secondary, still firing at this thing. <sighs> the Poncele has been sunk. I have no idea how any of these names are pronounced, by the way, so if it's completely wrong, I can only apologise. I know that it's 
like, bolognese. I say that, and now I'm thinking of spaghetti bolognese. I actually prefer chili con carne. I am actually a little concerned by this. Tell them to pursue now, but what? how are you firing at a target like that? Oh my god. See, there's just so much to look about. Way that the ships buffet against the waves. How it just looks like this thing's about to wreck face in a second. Wait, hang on a minute. Oh! Oh! We did it! Wait, what? <laughs> that one ship it was the one ship at the back oh. <laughs> that was satisfying right though you can't you can't deny that that was fun oh my gosh all right well i tell you what i might tweak this a little bit but i am so so happy with what I have made. Like, there is just nothing. Oh, I love this ship. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. <laughs>